the nonprofit Teachers and Entrepreneurs Activate Change was founded in 2018 to promote entrepreneurial and technological education, collaboration and self-awareness, and supports programs for teachers. We have Tammy Robinson, the founder of Teachers and Entrepreneurs Activate Change, and facilitator of Barakia Boone with us to tell us more about the program and the Teach Her Summer Initiative. Welcome, Tammy and Barakia. Thank you Thank for you. having us. Absolutely. So much. glad to have you. Thank you. You are entrepreneurial anyway and yes. decided to, to begin this program for young girls. Tell me about what prompted this for you and why you created the program. Yes, so the program is actually for girls and boys, okay. but right now we're in the pilot stage for the girls. So the program came about as a result of me being an educator in the uh, St. Louis Public Schools over 20 years as well as a special school district uh, for a few years. And while in the education system, I would often bring in entrepreneurs to my students working with special needs kids. Um, in the back of my mind, I always, you know, just tried to cover all areas just in case there was that student that did not um, go off to a traditional college. So I wanted to provide them some opportunities to learn about different trades and other um, uh, business endeavors that they can kind of tap into to e help them earn a living when they graduated. Oh, for sure. What mm -hmm. a great idea to yeah. utilize people who were innovative and created businesses of their own as avenues and, and opportunities for the students. Yes. Okay, so then from there it evolved into the the organization? Yes, it did. All right. What, what, what was the next steps from just the idea to actually having your initial year going this year? The next step was a lot of prayer, <laughs> a lot of prayer. Right. Um, you know, I am a spiritual person, so I believe that I yeah. was led in this direction. Um, I felt like naturally this was the next thing for me to do. After I left the school system, I, just, I was always an entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. um, after I left the school system, I opened up a women's clothing store. Mm -hmm. I want to shout out Synergy Shop Tea. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> um, but in addition to that, my store would often have uh, charitable type events or uh, situations where I would help the public. So. I've always been that type of person, whether it was with totes and toiletries or uh, coats for kids or collecting turkeys for Thanksgiving for different families. Yeah. I always like to give back in different ways. And so naturally for me as a woman, I like to serve women and I enjoy working with kids and nurturing them and trying to help them figure out what it is that they want to do in life. So. Um, just from the, uh, uh, me transitioning from the school system right. uh, into what I'm doing now, sure. it was a lot of uh, thought process involved, um, but I felt like this was the natural thing for me to do. I am tapping into my purpose, right, so right. that's why I'm here. Well, it makes perfect sense. Yes. As you were figuring out what you're doing and you're talking with and utilizing entrepreneurs who had to figure it out too, yes. mm -hmm. and then they are, are, they are passing on those very valid skills, necessary skills, that's right. to the young people you work with. So tell me about the Summer Initiative and how Baraki is involved. Yeah, so Facebook is powerful. Yes, it and is. And I watch, I watch you, I watch a lot of people <laughs> on social media, and that's how I came across uh, Baraki Boone, as well as some of the other uh, women yes. that are involved in Teach Her. Okay. Um, reached out to these ladies, and some of them reached out to me, just for me putting different questions on social media, trying to draw people in, just to kind of like see if they were interested in doing anything right. with Teach Her. So some she, of that yeah. knowledge over to your, yeah. to your students. Yeah, so Barack, so Barack yeah. what, what have you done and showed and shared through your entrepreneurial journey with the students that you work with? Okay, so I also am a former educator as well, <laughs> who awesome. has turned full-time entrepreneur. I am the owner and founder of Honey Bee's All Natural Hair and Skin Care. Okay. Um, I don't have a complete line. I would like to expand at some point. Um, but mm -hmm. I knew the importance of bridging the gap between education and entrepreneurship mm -hmm. and helping children to understand sustainability and being innovative and creative being the highest level of thinking. Um, so oftentimes within the education system, we miss children's genius just mm -hmm. because it might not be rote memorization. Mm -hmm. Studies have shown that um, people who are innovative and creative are the people who actually run the world. So it's yeah, really yeah. important for me 
to share my own personal experience with children and um, give them advice about how to carve out their path and their niche in this world. Mm -hmm. And just super excited to pass on what I have and learn from them as well. We love it. Well, yep. these are your products here that you share and speak about. And it's really great that you're able to bring that information and knowledge mm -hmm. to them. Yes. And I think that just makes it even more for, for yeah. fruitful for you yes. and the organization. Absolutely. We're gonna take a quick break. Stay with us at STL Live. We'll have more about the teacher summer initiative right after this. <laughs>